Welcome to my YouTube channel. Tonight, I'm going to have a talk with you guys, see how your week's been. I'm going to show you a mini haul. Excuse me. I know I can count on you. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Tonight, I'm going to have a talk with you guys, see how your week's been. I'm going to show you a mini haul. But first is I was going to go to the hospital tonight, which I went to the hospital tonight, and um, I found out that to get your CT scan, they open at 9 o'clock in the morning and close at 4.30 in the afternoon. And the lady basically said on the phone that my CT scan, they could see me at 6.55pm tonight. So we went to the hospital and they weren't open. They apparently shut at 4.30. So now we have to book another appointment to see, um, to see to get the CT scan next week. So I'm going to try and get that done next week. So yeah, so I didn't get it done yet. So that's been my night. Then we stopped off and got some pizza for dinner. Um, meat, meat sauce or something. And I got... Um, margarita with barbecue sauce so yeah so that was our dinner tonight and then we're going to share some chocolate sh um, chocolate sauce Cheerios or something I don't know what they are but like Cheerios breadsticks so yeah so that has been my night I've been busy all day babysitting my nephew Alexander which we went to the shops and just got some lunch and came home and had lunch because I've just been really tired and haven't been well, haven't been feeling well. Um, so, yeah, um, my knee still hurts, which is going to take a while to get better. And I feel like I'm starting to get a cold again. Like, it's been really cold here in Australia. It's freezing in Brisbane. Um, but, yeah, it's been really cold because it's winter. So, yeah, it's my husband's birthday next Monday. My husband is turning 33, so I'm trying to sort something out with him as well so we can have something, you know, like just husband and wife, like go out for dinner or go out for lunch or something. So I'm trying to sort that out uh, for next week. Um, this weekend I'm planning on sorting something out with all my family members, like my brother, my sisters and so forth, to go to have lunch in Brisbane City. So I'm trying to sort that out and see what happens. Hopefully it happens because that's what we want to do or we'll go out for lunch next weekend or something. So, yeah. Um, I had to give my little guinea pig Teddy a little bath tonight. And the thing is, he cage was, like, we cleaned his cage today. Oh, Ted, Ted, you're going crazy, boy. What's wrong? Oh, okay. Anyway, I cleaned, we cleaned his cage tonight and we haven't got any hay left. So we're about to get him some hay. And um, so we're going to sort out to get him some hay. We probably might not be able to get any until next week. So at the moment he is sleeping on some magazine and newspaper. And I had to put a little blanket in there because it's really cold. But I had to give him a bath because he made himself really dirty and... He was due for a bath, like, instead of doing it tomorrow night, I'm done his tonight. And I also blow, gave him a little warm blow dry as well. That's why his fur's all puffed up. We were going to cut his nails tonight, but um, he doesn't want that done. You want your carrot? Here. Yeah. Carrot. And um, so his nails were all puffed up. Not nails. So his fur's all puffed up from the blow dry. Um, so me and my husband just blew dried him just then. Here. Um, so, yeah, he's just a little fur ball, aren't you? Yeah. Anyway, so when we went to the shops today, there was a bookstore in uh, Bingley. And there's $5 books. And I wanted to get a $5 book. And my husband wanted to get one. So I bought my husband one. So he picked this one. Joey um, Sagreffa or something. It's about his real life um, journey. Um, and my husband likes this book. So 
He wanted this. It's got pictures of him and how he met some people, which I will show you some of this in a minute. So, yeah, so that's really looks very interesting. And then I picked the print and stamp collection. And I think I like I like prints and stuff and stamps. So yeah, so it came with two print um, I don't know what they print cases. And then it came with sponges at the top and then a cork. I don't know why a cork. Maybe to do more <clears throat> decorations. And then it came with like um, some tape and I haven't opened it yet. So I thought I'll open it with you guys tonight. So yeah. I was going to do a um, vlog tonight, um, but as I said, I was going to the hospital. I thought that I was still be in hospital now getting all this test done, CT scan, but they weren't open. So I just came home not long ago. We just had dinner, and now I'm filming with you guys. So I'm sorry about that. I haven't done a vlog this week. Um, I'll try my best to do one next week. It's just I've been busy, and... Last night I filmed my sister, which you would have seen by now, so we put it up uh, last night. So, yeah. So it comes with these stamp, I don't know what they are, stamp things, yeah. It comes with two stamp things, sticky tape, and these little rubber sponges. I think they're rubbers, they look like rubbers to me, but anyway. And then it comes with this really cool book. Um, so, I can do like, okay, so the cork is like a stamp. Okay. So, these are the things I can do in the book. So, that's why we've got a cork to make the little circles and flowers and things like that. I'm going to definitely make something out of this book. It sounds really cool. I'll probably use it, do something like this for my art show next week or something. But, um... Yeah, so I'm really looking forward to using this. I don't know where this came from. So, yeah, very looking forward to using this. So, very interesting. Very different, very interesting. And uh, $5, why not? So, yes, and it says stamp. So, yeah, so I'm looking forward to doing that. Um, <clears throat> before I show you some pictures of that in my husband's book, I'm um, that my husband bought. Um, my book is not going to be as big as this because I'm doing my book um, now and I've got pictures and so forth and you basically have to buy the book online um, because I'm not going to be like I do want to sign some and stuff like that I don't know how that works um, but this year I'm basically going to have my own book but not like this um, not thick like this no way um, probably just be like I don't know how th uh, thick my book will be, but you, I will show you everything when the time comes because at the moment I'm trying to finish it. So, yeah. So in <coughs> Joey's book, there is some pictures and things. I just want to show you some of these pictures. Now, <clears throat> if you can see here, that is apparently Joe when he was younger over there. And then over here, um, <clears throat> okay, Alfie days and all that. Okay, so over there, if you can see that big photo, that's apparently all his friends of YouTube. So the ones in this book um, that he put in was Tanya Burr, Alfie days, um, Jim Champion, Tylee, Tyler Oakley, I think, Marcus Butler, um, Lois, uh, Zoe, and yeah, and Louise, and so forth. So yeah, <clears throat> so it is a really cool book. It's like all his YouTube friends and <clears throat> his people he's met and him as a kid. So... Yeah. Okay. So there's 
just see if I can read this one. This one is reasons to be friends with your siblings. One, you never know when you need someone to bring you to bring you toilet paper. <laughs> <coughs> That's funny. Two. They will cover for you if you break something. Oh, yeah, that's true because I used to cover when my sisters used to break something. So, yeah. And they used to, I used to get in trouble instead of them. So, yeah. Number three. They will help you come with come up with a and something if you break something. I don't know what that means. Number four. You get a lifetime of inside jokes that no one else will understand. Mm. I've never done that one before, but yeah. Number five, they can help you break into new something, something, something. Break a pencil or break, don't know. I think it says break into a pencil, new pencil. I don't know, whatever. And number six, you can trust them way more than your friends to be honest with you about you something work okay so anyway they're the reasons to be with siblings it's really interesting isn't it teddy and then he's got a few more weird games he used to play with nicole or something uh i wonder something to be judged my sister would Something different class in front of me. I love using my mum wooden meat mallet as a glove. Okay. Um, glove. Meat mallet as a glove. I don't know what it means. Anyway. Um, okay. Uh, in real life. A foster home we packed up. Toilet sheet bags full of snacks, bottles of water, and go off to live on our own in the woods. Mm, okay. How to approach strangers in the something. Don't freak out if you don't have a place to sit. Approach a table. Ask if anyone is sitting at an empty seat. If you get something, move on and try again. Don't get something if people are rude. Just keep trying and no matter what, don't be afraid to sit by yourself. It can something help something as air of... Oh, yeah. Sorry, I can't read that. But yeah, <clears throat> I think it's basically saying what he used to do in his real life. Like he used to go to a barbecue or this looks sounds like a camp. So yeah. Okay, it's a lot of a uh, lot of lot to read. My husband's going to read this because it's his book. But um, yeah, I think he bought this book because I'm into like because I'm a YouTuber. I'm into so many YouTubers now. Like I want to know more about uh, what they do, and um, and I'm really interested in finding out what they do um, as a YouTuber. And I bought Alfie Day's slash Pointless Blog book, and I love it. Um, I can't read it or anything, but I look at the pictures. My husband's read a bit of it, and um, it's very interesting about his life story. And I think this book is mostly about his life story as well. So they're very interesting to have something to look upon when, I don't know, when you're feeling down and you, you haven't met them before and you want to know more about them. Um... But, yeah, it's just really interesting. So, yeah, I, that's why I think Mitchell bought it for himself. Teddy? What are you doing, darling? No one can see you. What are you doing? Anyway, um... Yeah, so I think that's why Mitchell bought it. But then he keeps saying that he wants to read it and tell me what's about and stuff. So I I don't I don't know why he bought it, but um, I think he bought it because I like like I looked at it first and thinking, oh, should I get this or should I get that? And we only had like a ten dollars budget, so I thought I'll get this because this is so interesting for my art show and stuff about stamps. 
And then Mitchell was going to get a book about um, making his own beer. Um, but then he found I found this book, and then I said, "Nah, it's all right. I don't like. I'll get this instead of this." And then Mitchell just wanted this, so he got this. I don't know, but yeah, but it looks very interesting. I um, I think Mitchell would like this, so I'm happy I bought it for him. It was only five dollars, and it's his his birthday next week, which I've got to buy him more stuff. But um, and this is not a birthday present or anything; it's just like a little gift. But um. Yeah, it's, it is a very interesting story. Um, it looks very interesting. Um, but, um, yeah, so that's very interesting. So, anyway, guys, um, today, as in, I haven't been, like, too busy. Um, like, what I mean by too busy, I've I had um, my nephew here today and we... Um, we had lunch and um, he was sitting on the chair in my little ki in my kitchen, and uh, he likes to feed himself like uh, food, and he's so cute. Anyway, he made a mess on the t chair like little kids do, and um, I said to him, "So you're still hungry?" And he looked like he. He was tired because he was rubbing his eyes, so he probably was getting tired. So um, he didn't really eat all his lunch today. Um, he ate a little bit of it. Like, he ate as much as he can because he's only little. Um, <clears throat> so, yeah, and then I thought I had some milk in the fridge, which I didn't. And then I found out I didn't have any milk, so he was crying. So then I found some juice, some really apple blackcurrant juice I bought from... Um, this place I go to, it's, um, what place do I go to? Lighthouse, which they've got, like, cool, cheap food and stuff. And I go to another place where I live. And, um, he liked the juice. So, at the first he cried because he thought it was milk. And then when I gave it to him in his beacon, he loved it and drank it. So, yeah, it was actually nice juice. And his mum gave us gave him some mandarin we shared that mandarin actually it was really nice uh he didn't want much of it um but yeah that's just been my day really we did some little bit of dancing in my office he started to dance with me and everything it was really cute um uh but yeah so my day hasn't been as i said pro like as busy like i did some washing i washed some clothes today um for outside, I washed some clothes for inside, um, but we had to hurry and go because we thought we had the, well, it did say we did have appointment tonight for my CT scan, but that didn't work out, did it? And um, we had to go to Sunnybank, well, that's where my appointment was, and uh, we got there and we, we went to the front desk and the lady said to me, um, so yeah, what are you here for? And I said, oh, I'm here for a CT scan. Oh, okay. Um, all you have to do is go up to stairs to level one. Okay. So we went up to stairs to level one and we found out that they were closed. Like we thought there was more. Anyway, so me and my husband's looking around and seeing if anywhere else was open and, uh, nowhere else was open upstairs. So then we went to level two. Um, because we banged to this lady and we walked out the coral doors. Well, there was like this little door thing and then you walk through and there was like these corridors. And we met this lady and um, we're about to go inside because Mitch was like, oh, yeah, maybe your CT scan's in there. And she's like, oh, no, 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 sorry. Um, the, the, there is a CT scan place on level two. And we're like, okay. So we went on level two and... There was only a doctor surgery there or a clinic or something. Anyway, I went into the clinic and I asked him, I said, so um, I'm here for a CT scan. Is there anywhere open? She's like, yeah, there is, but there is only an MRI scan downstairs on level, um, ground level. And I said, oh. And she's like, you can go and ask them some info, but they shut the doors for CT scans around 4.30. And I'm like, oh, Okay, so we went back downstairs to G ground 
and I was going to go into the um, MRI scan place to find out some info about how does this CT scan work, like what time they open and stuff. And we just like, no, no, it's all right, don't need to worry because we had the form at home. We've got the form to ring up. So my husband's going to ring up tomorrow morning and um, apparently they open around 9 o'clock and they close around 4.30. So I have to get around that time to go and get my CT scan. So we're going to try and book appointment next week in the afternoon. So I'm still getting it done, um, but I'm not getting it done until next week now because we found out it wasn't open tonight, which it wasn't. We went upstairs, as I said, and we got told it's downstairs and upstairs and downstairs, and it just wasn't there until we found out it was closed. So that has been my night. It's been really crazy. And it's freezing cold outside. And um, my husband was hungry. We were, like, we both were hungry. We were hungry for dinner because I was going to make my stir fry tonight for you guys and do a vlog about it, which that didn't work out. So now I've got to do a... Might be doing and well, not cooking show tomorrow because I do gaming show tomorrow night with my husband Mitchell. So um, I might be doing a cooking vlog next week. I'm planning on doing that. Um, I'm gonna buy my husband a cake from a cake store. Don't know where yet um, for his birthday and next week. But I'm gonna try and get it on Sunday because we're all trying to get together on this Sunday at um, in the Brisbane city. So, I don't know if I'm going to, yeah, it's very, very confusing. But, it's nearly the weekend, tomorrow is Friday, and tomorrow I think I am looking after my nephew again. Um, I don't know if I am yet, but yeah. So, yeah, what are you eating? What are you eating? Teddy? What are you eating? Anyway, if you're new to my channel, hi, I'm Jennifer McBride. I do shows Mondays, Tuesdays, Wednesdays, Thursdays, Fridays, and Saturdays. I don't do shows on Sundays. If you're new to my channel, hi, I have three link pigs and a cat, Mia, Sylvia, Ginger, and Teddy. So, yeah. Last night when I was talking to you guys that Ginger isn't mine, it is true. Ginger is my sister Sophie's guinea pig, which I'm babysitting him here. Um, so yeah, so it is my sister Sophie's, but I'm just looking after him. I've, I have looked after him nearly for two years now. Um, so yeah, that's why I always say he's mine because <laughs> he lives here. Um, but it, she, he is really Sophie's. So anyway, yeah. So I'm going to go and get the phone. I won't be a sec. You want to stay here, Ted Ted? Okay, you said that. I won't be a sec. Alright guys, I'm going to show you one of my shows um, that I did last night. If you guys haven't seen it, I'll just show you a clip of it now. It was very funny. Um, Sophie, she is my sister. As I said, I have three sisters and a brother. So I'm the oldest out of my three sisters. And um, filming with my sister Sophie is just really good. I love filming with Sophie. She's like, I don't know, She's she's got the potential and she's not scared on camera so that that's what that's really good and um me filming with her I loved it it was really good and I I guess you guys loved it too because you guys watched it and I just want to read some of the comments that you guys wrote to me um I will be writing back to you guys I'm really sorry it's been taking me time you know um but I will be writing back don't you worry so I'm going to show you my, one of my shows that I put up last night Tonight, I'm going to be 
doing a show with my husband Sophie. Husband Sophie. <laughs> 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 you too, yeah. Tonight I'm going to be doing a show with my sister Sophie. <laughs> Sophie? <laughs> Um, I said I was going to vlog tonight, but instead, my plans changed. My plans changed. <laughs> <laughs> so, my plane, my plane. <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, um, this is the show I did with my sister Sophie last night. It was so funny, guys. Um, it was actually a failure, like, in, with the challenge we did, um, which I shouldn't talk about too much of it, um, so you guys can watch it. But it was just so funny. Um, me and Sophie, we just get along like peas in the pod. Like, we're very, very close. We've always been close since she was a little baby. You right there, Tony? And, um, yeah, and I love filming with us. She's just really cool filming. And when she said to me on the phone yesterday afternoon, do you want to come over? We'll film. I'm like, yes, please, um, because I haven't filmed with her for a week. And so I'm really happy I did it. But, yeah. Anyway, I wanted to read some comments of this, the show I just showed you. Um, just show you the comments. Okay, so the first comment I got was from something baby. Full view, exciting video. Thanks, dear. Friends, super like, thumbs up. Have a wonderful Wednesday. Thank you very much, baby. I can't pronounce the other name, but thank you very much from the bottom of my heart. Thank you. I'm so happy you enjoyed it. And um, thank you for, you know, just being so supportive. Thank you. Little life for little things. Hi, best friend. You guys are so funny. This was great. Take care. Thank you very much, life for little things. You're a sweetheart. You really are. And um, it was funny. It was. Thank you. Uh, Shelby, cry, cry, girl. This was so so cute and fun. Thank you very much, Shelby, cry, cry, girl. You're such a sweetheart. Thank you. Um, something, dad. Thumbs up. Thank you very much. Um. Then I did a painting, which I will just read you the comments. So I got 11 comments. So the first comment I got was for Cheryl and family. You did a very good, you did very good. Thank you very much, Cheryl and family. Thank you. Quite, am quite amazing job, girl. Thank you very much, Shelby Cry Cry Girl. Hi, best friend. You did awesome on your painting. Love how it turned out. Have a nice day. Hugs. Thank you very much, Life with Little Things. It's such a sweetheart. Thank you. Hollywood. Cool painting. Cool paint job. Thank you very much. Lovely. Thank lovely. Thanks for sharing. Thank you very much. Music just for you. No copyright. Thank you. T vlogs. It seems like a few people I watch are changing up their channel. Nice and fun. Nice and fun painting. Thank you very much for the bottom heart. Thank you. Fantastic. Big thumbs up. Thank you very much. Something, Dad. <laughs> Sorry, I can't pronounce it, but yeah, thank you. <clears throat> now, I did the time for a change and I've got eight comments. So I'm going to read some now. From Rosita Vela. Hi, sweetheart. This is a good change and move thing and move things around because it's more comfortable for you. Wow, them CDs movies are so adorable. Lol, blue is also my favourite colour. I just love my blues. Thank you. Thank you for my shout out, sweetie. Sweetheart, no one on this YouTube has ever gave me a shout out as you have. Thank you so much for a million. You are rock. You rock gold, my friend. 
I'd be praying for you, my sweet friend, and thanks for thanks for everything, sweetheart. God bless. Thank you very much, Rosita. You're such a sweetheart. Thank you for the heart. Thank you. Shereen family. Hi, Jen. Thanks for the shout out. I understand on your channel changes. Thank you very much for understanding, Sharon family. Thank you. Something, Dad. Home, home scan comes back all clear. Thank you for the bottom of my heart. Thank you. Me too. Haven't had it yet. <laughs> You're going to be very busy. Need links in descriptions. Oh, yeah. Sorry. I will put those links in the descriptions. Mitchell, can you fix the links in the descriptions for Monday shout outs? Oh, really? They've done it again? Yeah. Oh, my God. I know. Girl, you're amazing. I love the top, your voice, and glasses. I just love watching you. Always have. Always have. Thank you very much, Shelby Cry Cry Curl. I love watching your shows. Your shows are fantastic too. Thank you. Donna Sky. Hey, don't worry. You do it. You do. You don't worry about the shout outs. Have fun with your channel. Forget what other people say about you. Doing shout outs. Take care of yourself. Thank you very much, Donna. Thank you. Hi, best friend. Thanks for the shout out. I hope you are having a great day, hugs. Thank you for the heart. Thank you. So, yeah, they're all the comments so far I've read. Um, so, yeah, I just wanted to read those comments um, because I haven't read any for a while um, for this week. So, I thought I'll do that something a bit different. Anyway, if you follow my Snapchat, Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter, you will find me there. You guys can talk to me there if you want to because, as I said, I only film every um, every week except Sundays. Um, so Every day except Sundays. So, yeah, so if you want to talk to me on those um, pages, you guys are welcome to. I'm always on Snapchat all the time. I'm always on Twitter. I do a lot of live streams on Twitter. Um, I'm always on Instagram and I'm always on Facebook. So, yeah, so if you guys want to check – Check the um, my channel. If you want to check my media, you guys are welcome to. I would love to have you there with me, like you guys are with me now on my YouTube channel. So, yeah, so if you want to come and talk to me and enjoy talking to me and I talk to you, you're more than welcome to. So, yeah. Um, so, Every art show I do, um, you guys are really welcome to um, do the um, art I do um, by taking photos, um, if you want to do the art that I do and sending it to my media like my Facebook, Twitter, Snapchat or Twitter and I'll be happy to see the photos of my art that you are doing. That will be really good. I don't mind. Um same with my cooking. If you're interested in following my cooking shows, how I'm starting, like how I do different cooking dishes, you guys are welcome to do the same. If you do, don't forget to take a photo, as I said. Uh, put it on media, on my media, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and Instagram, and I would love to see it on those pages, and I will talk to you there too. Um yeah, so I just wanted to just basically have a talk with you guys. I didn't really want to do much tonight because I didn't know I was going to film tonight because I wasn't really going to because I was going to be in hospital getting my scan done, which that didn't work out. So, um, yeah, it was just something a bit simple and, yeah. But if you're new to my channel, I'm going to show you one of my guinea pigs um, named Teddy, which because he's with me at the moment. And, um, yeah, Teddy, come and see the viewers, Bobby. Mwah. Say hi. Say hi. Carrot. And carrot. Oh, Teddy. Teddy. Hey, that's naughty, Teddy. I think he's a bit tired. You're tired. Come over here. 
Anyway, so this is my little guinea pig named Teddy. He is really cute. Um, I don't know why he's... What's wrong? Okay, um, what, what, what? Anyway, he's just really cute, guys. So cute. Watch out. Watch out. Gotcha. Gotcha. Anyway, guys, if you like my show, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. I do shows every week except Sundays. I love you guys a lot, and I'll see you again tomorrow night for the gaming show with my husband, Mitchell. Love you guys a lot. Thank you very much for all the support, the sweet comments, and I'll see you again tomorrow night. Bye. Bye. Come on, Teddy. Say bye-bye.